So let me let me just draw a bit of a. Do you, do you think we're coming out of that? I think we're moving more and more into that. Right, you know, the me... Matter and Matter and Alex are going to turn Lama fully closed. Great. So let's 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 go back to that in just one second. I want to answer the question that because you, you actually asked uh, uh, like a great question on, on how I view this, and let's go to whether we're we're coming out or not. So right. so how do I think about safety? So I you know I was actually very very close to security during the rise of the internet. You know I worked for the intelligence community. Um, I, work, I work for Livermore um, uh, National Labs. And then, you know, when I did my PhD, like, you know, a, a good, you know, 50% of my work was in security. I taught like a cybersecurity policy course. And the thing with the internet is you had these very specific examples of, of new types of attacks that like impacted nation states, like critical infrastructure would go down, you know, you'd have things like the Morris worm, like, you know, I mean, you had these really significant examples. And, and that kind of kicked off this, this large discussion on how you how you handle it and 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 it was so significant at the time that at the nation state level you know we started thinking that we have to actually change our our, our doctrine you know you were kind of this cold war era mutually assured destruction we had to change it to this notion of like defense asymmetry which meant the more we relied on these things the more vulnerable we were right as opposed to like a country that didn't rely on them because you could be attacked and then of course kind of the whole terrorist information warfare stuff and so the implications were so absolute and you had so many proof points and you could articulate them incredibly well and so if you look at the ai stuff i mean for every computer system you have security considerations but we've got this 30 40 year very robust discourse around this that we can draw from and use from and the thing that I don't understand is how all of a sudden we've decided that these are not computer systems, they don't obey the same laws, and we have to kind of throw out everything that we've learned and kind of like revisit the discourse, even though we don't even have the the, the same proof points. I mean, like, nobody can make a strong argument on asymmetry or, or need a shift of doctrine. And if they can, let's go ahead and have that discussion. 